Welcome to Florida day eight. Today we are off to Target and Best Buy and then possibly going to one of the parks later for a couple of hours. Not sure which one, um, but it, it won't be a long one. It would just be a pop in and um, just have a little walk around, go on what we can and then home. So let's go to Target. Heading into Target now. They even have a Starbucks in here. This place is just massive. So they do McDonald's coffee, Krispy Kreme coffee, Cinnabon boxes. This is the sweet and chocolate aisle. So many sweets. And then they do the different flavoured M&M's. They've got peanut butter, fudge brownie, almond caramel, dark chocolate. Here's the Oreos aisle. They have so many different types of Oreos. And then they've got all the Chips Ahoy. Here's the cleaning aisle. Cleaning products galore. This is their laundry sanitizer. $9.99, Lysol and Clorox and OxyClean. They do loads of floaty bits in here. They're really cool. And they also do kids ones, I think, around here. Oh no, they're just rubber rings. They're awesome though. All of these pool games and stuff are really cool. The home section in here is lovely. Look at the look at the outdoor fires, patio heaters. They're beautiful. Wow, twenty percent off at the moment. Wow, look at these, they are gorgeous. They even sell bikes in Target. Their supermarkets are just blooming huge. <laughs> Kids toys is like Toys R Us. It's like Toys R Us used to be, it's massive. And everybody loves these little mini brands. So here they're $6.99. They've literally got everything you can imagine here. <laughs> I would definitely say bring as many nappies as you can if you're coming out here because they are really expensive. So for a pack of 50 Huggies, you're looking at $26.99. Huggies do Mickey ones though, but again for 124 24 that's not that bad. It's still a lot more money than home though. Pampers Baby Dry, look how much it is for 104 nappies, it's It's really expensive. Really, really expensive. But if you buy two, you get a free $15 gift card, which I suppose is good if you're going to come back and get them from here again. But there's so much money, 132 Nappies for forty two ninety nine. <sighs> wow. Karen's showing everyone around. Look at this. This is cool. Is this Barbie? Our generation. Look at this. Barbecue. Where you can set the dolls. Oh my gosh, look at all the outfits. Oh, it's th these dolls. Our generation. 
They have so much stuff for these dolls. Look at the kitchen. Look at the fridge. Comes with a, a full fridge. That is really, really, really cool, isn't it? The barbecue actually comes with gas. <laughs> That's hilarious. Wow. Oh, look at this one with a wheelchair. Broken foot. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, your Peppa Pig and your Bluey. Sesame Street bus. <laughs> Look at the Mickey fire engine, that's so cool. And they've got so much Paw Patrol stuff. This is all Paw Patrol, you couldn't take that back with you if you, if you wanted to. It's 15% off, 149.99 for the city tower. Awesome. I think their wipes are a little bit similar to our price. So for a pack of three water wipes, it's 49.99. I think at home it's 11 pound. So they're a little bit more expensive here. And then you've got all your easy up pants, which are still quite expensive. Not sure what swaddlers are. Don't know what swaddlers are. Might be the old type of old school diapers. I don't know. And their pull-ups are just as expensive. <laughs> For a pack of 94 pull-ups, you're looking at $34.99. Absolutely love the Kate Spade stuff in here. They've got wires, they've got air tag cases, air pod cases, which are so pretty. I don't think they're a bad price either. And then they've got all your phone cases. I'm thinking of getting this one. It's probably my favorite, but these are really, really pretty. And then you've got the clear. So that's a rough price of the car seats in Target. There's a sale on at the moment, and the cheapest one's 152.99 for a normal car seat. Target have a deal with Disney, so they've got all your Disney stuff. The T-shirts are cheaper than that little shop I went in yesterday. Me and Mel shorts are really cute. They are $12.99 and then they do the plushies. But it's legitimate Disney because they actually have to deal with Disney. So they've got all the kids stuff. It's cute, $11.99 for a Gogogu T-shirt. And they do little dresses. Four little girls which are $14.99. They have loads and loads of stuff. Disney. They do towels, little frozen sunglasses, which are funny at the top there. They're $9.99, little bags. That stitch vest is cool. $14.99. And then men's t-shirts as well. You're looking at $13.99 a t-shirt. And ponchos you're better off getting in here rather than actual Disney. Because they are... I've no clue how much they are, but they're definitely going to be cheaper than Disney World. <laughs> That's Target done. So I've got a couple of little bits, um, just a couple of cleaning bits really, and a top to take home. I'm going to split with my friend Lee. Karen, we're parked down this one. So yeah, Target is done. Karen, what did you get in what did you get in Target? What's in your bag? She got a few. She got a few little bits. Oh, oh, picked up a nice AirPods Pro case. Very nice. They were the ones that I showed. They were $34.99. Had a couple of different ones. I really like that one. And I really like the Daisy one, but I couldn't make my mind up, so I didn't actually get one at all. So, um, yeah, they had really nice watch straps in there as well. Kate Spade watch straps, which match the cases, which were really nice, but again, didn't bother. This, this was ours, but they've driven round. The boys, our bib and us, our, our rhubarb is here. 
<laughs> Even the door's open for us. <laughs> we are at the loop, back at the loop now, and we've come over the other side. So we're heading into Johnny Rocket for lunch. It is 10 past 12. They've got the cinema here as well. And um, a couple of shops down there, Ben and Jerry's. They've got a massive, massive bed, bath and beyond just down there. Here we go. Johnny Rockets for lunch, baby. This is awesome. A booth, yeah. We're in a booth. Mm -hmm, yeah. Here's the menu for Johnny Rockets. They've got some limited milkshakes which look phenomenal. The cinnamon, cinnamon toast crunch. Yeah, that's what I'll get. Burgers. The other crayon, I think. Lucas got well. He had his hat on. Not anymore. <laughs> had his Johnny Rockets hat on. He's doing some colouring in at the moment. Oh, he's got his Johnny Rockets hat back on now. <laughs> Ooh. My milkshakes just arrived. I've gone with banana strawberry. The milkshakes here are insane. The food has arrived, so we've gone with normal tater tots. Onion rings, we're just chucking everything down the side. <laughs> Onion rings. We've got sweet potato fries as well. And now we've got the bacon cheese fries en route. And a toddler escaping from his high chair. These are the bacon cheese fries. Mm -mm. My Philly cheese steak has arrived. It's so good. Tommy's gone for the smokehouse burger. Looks banging. We've gone for a right old feast over here. Bit of everything. <laughs> I'm defeated. Couldn't even eat it all. Absolutely defeated. That was insane. That was so good. Wasn't salty at all, just <laughs> amazing, just as I remember it. Just having some time by the pool now. We're all just relaxing. Baby's in the pool. He's not enjoying it at all. And we're just chilling out. That's my bed right there. Today we went to we had breakfast at home, went to Target, did some shopping um, just for some bits and bobs that we needed. Then we went back to the villa, chilled by the pool for hours. It's now 6 p.m. and um, we just had a spontaneous moment and we're off to Disney's Hollywood Studios. So we've just made a park reservation and um, yeah, that's where we're heading. So. Um, quite excited. Let's go to Hollywood Studios. Luca, you absolute legend. We're heading into Hollywood Studios. We're lastminute.com, aren't we? We're gonna, gonna try go on Rise of the Resistance. Although you can't go on it because you're just a baby. Oh, wrong bit of thing. Wrong bit of the finger. Thank you. 
just heading on Star Tours now, just me and Karen. Oh, I'm sorry. It is a five minute wait. Okay, glad, glad. Baba, let's get this hat off. Say Batu. Baba say Batu. Batu. That's where we are. We're in Batu. 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 Baba. Batu. Yeah, that's where we are. And the bazaar is over there. That's the bazaar. And then just behind here, we are going to go on Rise of the Resistance. Baba can't go on though, so we do the child swap. Oh, book and boy. We're gonna go on Rise. Heading on to Rise of the Resistance now, 65 minute wait. And I'll try and get a little bit of footage. I'll insert where to skip to if you don't want to see what the ride is all about. BB-8, grab the ready room for recruits. Incoming transmission from Ray. Destroyer that is now headed to this system. Your outpost on Batu is no longer safe. Affirmative. Transport is ready. Nine of and I shall personally see them delivered. No need for safety.
we've just come off Rise of the Resistance. Alex, tell everyone what did you think of it? Wicked. Absolutely incredible. I absolutely love that ride. That was so good. That was so good. That might be one of my favourite rides. Just felt like it. Do you know what it felt like? It felt like it had all the favourite rides in one ride. The time now is 10 to 8, so we're running a bit late. But the um, other guys have just got on, so Tommy and Karen have just got on to the parents' swap. Cool. Luke has been walking around Batu. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'll pop a picture in of him walking. We didn't even bring any shoes, so not great, but yeah, I'm gonna get some blue milk. Gotta try it, it's, it's gotta be done. Luke has been walking around barefoot, bless him. <laughs> I can't even cope with him. He hasn't even got any shoes on. <laughs> so this is where you get the blue and the green milk. It's 8.49. Just got the blue milk. First sip for the vlog. It's like the cross, it is, it is, it's like a cross between Thank you, mate. It's fruity toothpaste. It's actually fruity toothpaste. Alex, you want to try? No. He doesn't want to try because he's seen a lot of people say it tastes like toothpaste and it made him feel sick. It is definitely fruity toothpaste. I don't know how I feel about it. It's actually quite nice. You sure? You love citrus fruit. You hate it. He doesn't hate it. The face, the face looked like you hated it. That is so funny. It definitely tastes like toothpaste with fruit. Doesn't it? It tastes like toothpaste with fruit. Yeah, it's a weird like, yeah, it's weird. Think of Rise of the Resistance. Oh, it was amazing! It was brilliant. So good. It was really. Tommy. Cool. Best ride I've ever been in my life. Yeah, I really actually agree. And also, try some of this blue milk. You obviously don't like it because it's not slow. Try it. <laughs> it's like fruity toothpaste. <laughs> That's not for me. It's not for me. <laughs> like those old-fashioned square sweets used to have that were chewy. I don't know, it's disgusting. It does taste like something and I couldn't put my finger on what it was. Maybe it is that. What colour were you in the ride? Silver. So were we? No way! Yeah, we were silver at the car. Yeah, we were silver too. Oh my gosh, it was so good. It was so good. Did you take pictures? Yeah, I took pictures. Did you? I, no, I asked him, but he never took I vlogged it. Okay. okay. So I got some of the pictures. Such a good ride. The Chinese theatre is lit up, looking beautiful tonight. It is 25 past eight now, and we're heading home. Luca's still awake. People have got their lightsabers out. I wonder what, how long the queue is for that? You can't go in any queue, I don't think now. Shot at eight. But they must be waiting for the show. Yeah, it's at nine. Ah, you might be able to queue then. Mickey and Minnie's. Yeah, yeah, I've seen it on the vlog. People are all sat here now, waiting for the projection light show. That happens here. Quite a lot of people, but we're heading home now because it's, well, like I said, it's 25 past eight, so Luca needs to go to bed. Um, we ha always have seem to be having 4am wake ups with him at the moment. He has 4am, has a croissant, has some milk, as in cold milk. 
and then goes back to sleep till well it's been eight but yeah i hope he doesn't wake up at four tonight but who knows he might do so we're heading home now we've just come into starbucks it's a late night starbies and this is the menu in starbucks the salted caramel cream salted caramel cream cold brew is hitting the spot for me right now it's going to be a decaf it all just looks it just looks lush look at the dragon drink as well that's the uh acai i think oh no they've got the refreshers there strawberry acai i wonder what the dragon drink is it's quite popular i think Hollywood Studios, we've had a great time here. What?